Hello everybody, my name is Luca, your favorite correspondent from space. We had several experiments uh, uh, ongoing and some of those that I would like to talk uh, about are actually European experiments. One of them is called Nutris, uh, smartly spelled with two S like ISS, nutrition for the ISS. It follows my diet really closely. I have a special application on my uh, tablet so that I can log in everything I eat for a period of five days and then we can do very fine measures of my body mass and figure out whether I am in a balance, I am in a deficit or I am overeating. And then from the ground they can suggest ways for me to improve my diet. Now wouldn't you love to have something like that on the ground? Exactly, you would, and that's why we're studying this on orbit. Another experiment uh, that has to do with the physiology is called time perception, uh, another cooperation, and this one uh, wants to analyze whether gravity affects our perception of time. And there are some uh, documents, uh, or there is some evidence actually, that uh, suggests that our time perception changes while we are in space. Uh, who knows, uh, maybe we'll figure out whether our brain thinks we're going, we're going faster or slower where we are, while we are in space. It, it might be connected to microgravity, or it might be connected to the fact that we're moving at 20, 28,000 kilometers an hour while free falling around the Earth. From the space station, I'm signing out. I'm Luca Parmitano, your space correspondent.